What's up, everybody? I'm Becky Sapphire, and welcome back to Disaster Log C. Wait, we have our saves. Which we're here. No, I don't. Oh, why does life do this to me? Here we are. Disaster Log C003, September. For a second, uh, I ate everything. Alright, back. Wanna go back? Oh my god, this video is off to a horrible start. Let's just get right back into it. Zasser Lager, C003, September 3rd, 8 27 a.m. At some point last night, an individual who seems to be from the coast struck a boy in my boat. I'm currently being held hostage by her. She identifies herself as is, and she's armed with a large knife. After an uh, exchange in which she realized I was necessary to keep this boat running, we came to a compromise. She's letting me live as long as I show her the ropes, so to speak. So we'll be doing that as slowly as I can manage. She's been asleep for two hours and 14 minutes. I uh, consumed it. Cautiously disarmed her, but I'm not confident she can physically she can be physically overwhelmed. She's a demon man and imitating and yet slender pirate of a shock teeth. Shock teeth. Strike, strike the last part. It's an uh, irrelevant. What's important is this incident and hasn't gotten in the way of my walker record data. Recording data. It has continued to rain as the study may wait through the night as I um, suspected with the previous log, my house is very likely submerged. I will continue with my original mission despite these uh, unforeseen circumstances with is. The net is still down and I am planning of making a person visit the weather center if I can. They will be able to make use of my data. It could possibly save lives and not yet explain the mission of Is in fear of sabotage. I'm not sure how she would react, uh, proceeding with extreme caution for now. End log. Trying to record uh, and conflict confidential uh, disaster logs while my captor sleeps. That's some pretty risky business. But I have to do my job, I have to survive. At least you're here with me, Barry. I'm going to keep you hidden so she doesn't dread and stab too. Well, that sucks. Zastalog C004, September 3rd, at 12.34pm. Upon finally waking up, my captain demands I make her breakfast. Peacefully, I completed her orders. Your footsteps still raining, Nanga. No net convert. Connection and log. Hey, hostage! You uh, lied about how much food there was, didn't you? What did you expect? Pretty gutsy of you. Don't lie to me anymore. Why is Jack the Plank? <laughs> Alright. Let's be uh, as honest uh, as possibly can then. Good. It looks like we'll be spending the next week, week or so together, so let's get to know each other. It's been pretty curious. I've been pretty curious about everything uh, on your Nord boat. What's all of your equipment for anyway? Explain everything. Explain only what's necessary. It measures atmosphere uh, connections. So, your job is to record the data that my equipment provides. And that's the data for analyzing water patterns. Wouldn't this be faster if you just explain it all at once anyways? What's the point of all this stuff when you can just look outside and see the weather for yourself? Because this equipment helps me predict the weather in advance. Can you see how valuable this is in our situation? So, you can tell me when the sun's coming out next? It's hard to say. I need more data. 
useless. Hey, at least you are honest. Good hostage. Do I get a turn to ask you something now? Mm, nope. Don't feel like it. Hurry up and teach me how your boat walks. Understood. Zasalog Sizu Pro 05, September 3rd, 10.35 p.m. Hostage Situation Update. I spent the entire day on Isaac's beacon call. I managed to draw out the boat's instructions till after the mid-afternoon lunch break. Around 5 p.m., I ran out of things to explain. I fully expect to be drawn overboard at this point with no um, continuously plan. However, she likes my cooking, and... Um, I decided to keep me around as some kind of hostage servant. Now that she's in charge of navigation I mean my ship, she insists I call her Captain Isa. Ugh. She is reckless, demanding, and takes joy in making me do her bidding, though. And for these reasons, I still believe she's some kind of demon. It's been difficult to do my work under these conditions, but I'm managing. Still no idea when the rain will let up. Beginning to think it won't. Because, beginning to think I'll die serving the demon captain, then in pointlessly measuring the continuous rain every couple of hours. And vlog this. I need to come up with a plan. I need a better uh, direction to steer towards. I'm just so hopeless I expected the net to come back by now. And I, I can't hope to make it make it to Region SS while I'm being held a hostage, obviously. If let's get in worse, I knew everyone expected it to get bad, but how far can the sea rise? How many casualties are we facing here? It's as if the ocean swallows, as the ocean is swallowing our entire world. What good is my data if all it's given me is despair? And to be me imminently taking a hostage at the onset of this voyage. How useless am I? Don't, don't be like that. Just don't, don't be like that. Try to find the good in things, like, you're not dead yet, you know? You still have your bear. And, well, you're not one of the casualties. Be happy about that. The Zasalog C006, September 4th, 7.33 a.m. Those long and hard lasting nights about what I should be doing decided to, be, to put survival first and for most the time being. Currently making breakfast for Captain Dennett, then Isa. She is no longer threatening me with a knife, so it's progress. Hey, that's. That's something good. I kept on the record the rainfall, of course. Uh, no major change in the past 24 hours. We are in open water now. Islands are barely visible and drew all the mist. No matter how far we go, the rain's the same fucking rain. Not sure if Captain Isa delightfully steering us somewhere or wasting fuel by. What you doing? Nothing. I'm actually ending my video right here. And with that, I'm going to leave this episode here. I know it was really, really short, but the school year started back up, you know? What can I say? I still have to go and do that stuff. It's like 11 here. I still have to edit the entire thing. So I'm going to leave this video here. See you guys in the next one. Bye.